Well, uh, you know, we're excited. Uh, it's a big game for us, obviously. And uh, I thought the biggest thing uh, that stood out to me tonight was how we defended them for most of the game. Obviously, late in the last couple of minutes there, we gave up some baskets. And, uh, but outside of that, for the majority of the game, we really defended them well, made, them, uh, made it difficult for them to score, which Brad did such a good job with his team defensively. It was hard for us to score. And, uh, but I thought our defense uh, won the game for us tonight. And then Ralston got going there in the second half. You know, he made some shots and loosened everything up for our team. We gained some confidence, I think, off of Ralston shooting. And uh, that was really big for us. But uh, from tip to buzzer, I, I liked how we guarded him. I thought we really did a good job. <coughs> Every year you've been here, you guys have played down here. It seems yeah. like every game's yeah. really mattered a lot. You know, just kind of your thoughts on what this, this arena's been. Well, this is a, uh, first of all, you know, Brad does a great job. He, he's got these guys where they, they're hard to score on. They're just, it's just hard. And, uh, you know, at halftime, it's 20 to 21, I think it was. And uh, you know, I felt good. I felt good. We only had 20, but they only had 21. And uh, but it's a tough place to play. Uh, great atmosphere. Their fans are great, and uh, we've been able to win in here a couple times. <clears throat> but uh, it's not easy. It is not easy. And I think that's because of the way they play <coughs> and how they guard you. They just really do a great job. So it makes getting baskets really difficult. Did you think after? The way you guys play on Saturday, that you would play better today, particularly on the defensive end. Yeah, I, I was. You know, <clears throat> you get home from Boston, and uh, you know, it, it's almost like when you have a big win, you want to just forget it. it's hard to do. And we didn't do a very good job of that. When we got a tough loss, you just got to forget it. You just got to get past it. Um, it's not one of those things for me that I wanted to walk into practice and yell and scream and throw chairs and all that kind of crazy stuff. We got our legs back under, <laughs> underneath us. We got our minds right. Uh, discard that game. Let's get back to play. And I thought we came in very focused defensively and really, really defended them well. So uh, pivotal game. It's a pivotal game for our, for our club. So nice bounce back after such a disaster the other night. Can you recall an ACC game where you <coughs> held your opponent 14 minutes without a basket? Not very often. I don't know the stats, if it's, but I don't know that we've done that. We're really usually not that great of a defensive team. <laughs> this year we're a little better. Yeah. But uh, I just tonight, well, I, I thought we were just locked in. We just really locked in. We locked in on their personnel. We talked a lot in the last couple of days about each particular player and what they do. And, you know, sometimes with players, you're not sure how much of that really registers. I thought to, in the last couple of days tonight, that really sunk in. And he did a really good job with that. But BJ helped us around the basket, blocked some shots, had a presence in there. Um, Leonard Freeman just did a great job. You know, Leonard, <coughs> Leonard's one of those guys that you know, he may not fill up the stat sheet for you, and, and uh, the boy does a lot of things to help your team. Sets screens at the right time, gets a put back, switches defensively when when it needs to be, and just does some really smart things for our team. And I thought that was uh, you know really important. Austin said, and he can't figure out this thing a little bit, just the ups and downs. Can you? We're the definition of Dr. Jekyll and Mr. Hyde now. I mean, we're all over the board. And, uh, but one thing I do like is our guys keep coming back. They keep competing. And I think a lot of times we all forget uh, that this is a young group. You know, we, we lost three starters off an NCAA tournament team last year. And so this has been a group that's kind of learning and they're, they're coming. And we've had ups and downs and we've been all over the place. But, uh, you know, they keep coming back with a great attitude and they keep competing. So, uh, obviously, we got to do that Saturday. We got a big game Saturday with Syracuse. But, um, you know, I like, the, I like our team. I really do. We just got to keep getting better.